Hello my diamonds, my TikTokers, Sheila True Love here, and yes, it is story time yet again. I moved across country for him and for love, and now I am trapped. Lord knows I regret this decision that I made. I moved here for him, moved here for love. Now I'm trapped. I haven't seen my family or friends in over a year. My grandfather is dying and I'm not sure when I'll be able to talk to him again. When I finally save up to book a uh, book travel, my husband finds a way to block me from going to visit my family. I was depending on him to care for the cat who lives in our home and he refuses because he's allergic. Even though anytime he needs to visit his family, I'm 100% there for them. Washing clothes, cooking food, packing lunch and medications for the plane so that it will be accessible to them. I never once hesitated to support him and his family in this way. Now that it's me and my family who need help, he's gone dark and completely ignored me. I can't leave without having a sound care plan for my pet. I'm not a heartless person. I'm begging my friends and you Miss True Love for help. It seems like no one else is answering. Learning no one is there when you actually need support from an abusive gaslighter is very heartbreaking and difficult to live with. I 100% know what needs to be done at this point and it begins with a divorce. I'm just still somehow upset that these men will lie to us about being providers and are so incapable of taking on any type of responsibility. Is it my fault for believing in him? Do you currently believe in a man who says he will take care of you no matter what? I have to rethink this. They say it, but they never do it and they never really mean it. So as you know, I will pin my response on my YouTube channel, Sheila True Love. And I will definitely um, do my best to assist. Well, I already gave her the answer, you know, and we kind of go back and forth, back and forth. But I will definitely pin my response in the comment area. Twinkle, twinkle, twinkle.